Hello crochet friends and welcome back. We're working on our chicken and today is wing day. We're making chicken wings. So I've made one. We need to make two. So this is what it will look like when we are all done and they're going to affix here to the sides of the body. Um, you can either attach it flat or have it sticking up like that a little bit if you'd like. Whatever you'd like. Always preference, right? So I'm going to put that aside. So we're using the same color as the body. Um, so that same yarn here and the same hook, three millimeter crochet hook. So let's get going. So we want to start again with a magic circle. Ooh, you're going to be pros at this, aren't you? So yarn over your hand, cross and go over again, right? Get that nice little cross there. So go under the first strand, grabbing the second, twist and pull it up on your hook. All right, we've got this now. So there is our nice little circle, right? And I'm going to work inside the circle here with six single crochets. Enter, yarn over and pull through, yarn over and pull through two. Enter again, yarn over and pull through, yarn over and pull through two. There's number two. This is going to be three, four, five, and six. Alrighty. That gives us our base to work off of for our wing. Okay. Now, I'm going to pull that little center a little tight there. Make sure we have six. One, two, three, four, five, and six all the way back there. So we're going to start in that number six right there for round two and we want to single crochet the next two stitches. So enter that first stitch, give it a single crochet, yarn over and pull through and pull through again for a single crochet. Go into your next stitch, yarn over and pull through, yarn over and pull through, two for a single crochet. Now it changes it up just a little bit. We want a half double crochet, a double crochet, and another half double crochet all in the next stitch. So yarn over, enter your next stitch there. Yarn over and pull through. We have three. Yarn over and pull through all three. That's your half double crochet. Yarn over, enter that same stitch. Oops. Yarn over and pull through. Yarn over and pull through two. Yarn over and pull through two. That's your double crochet. Yarn over, go in that same stitch one more time. Yarn over and pull through. We have three. Yarn over and pull through all three. That is your half double crochet. Okay, so that just builds it up and gives it um, that little end that looks like the point of the wing. Okay, so that was a half double crochet, a double crochet, and another half double crochet, all in the next stitch that we were working in there. Now we're going to put two single crochets in the next three stitches. So that's easy peasy, right? Here's our first single crochet in the next stitch. Go right back in, another single crochet. All right, next stitch, one single crochet. Go right back in, two single crochets. All right, we should have one more. One single crochet, two single crochets. All right, excellent. Now, I'm gonna pull my center a little tight and I'm going to cut this off. All righty. Pull up my loop. Okay, now, let's see here, we got ourselves going. What I did on the other one, just because I didn't like how this kind of stuck out here, I mean, I threaded my needle for, oh, get my one with the bigger eye on it. Sorry about that. When I threaded this, I just kind of went through the next stitch here just to get it to lay down a little bit. And I, I kind of liked the look of that better. Uh, that's me, um, you do you, right? So this pointy part where we put the double crochet, the half double crochet, and the other double crochet is going to go toward the back like that. So we are going to attach our little wings onto our chickens. So, so cute, I love it. All right, so I, 
we know that this was around row five and I think if we do the wings you know I'll just so it kind of touches up there um, that's just my thought you can put your wings wherever you would like um, again this is preference and um, you you make your chicken look like your chicken so I'm gonna get those wings on there like this okay that's what I'm suggesting and we're going to attach them you can like I said you can have it flopping out if you want or you can have it completely attached I think because I'm going to use mine as a keychain I think I'm going to completely attach my wings and I'm going to do the same thing on the other side with the second wing because remember you have to make two right so I have these little keychain things which I'm going to attach at the top here I have my little needle nose pliers over here, so I'm going to attach that there. Should you want it to just be a string loop, you know, just attach your yarn in the middle there and give it a little loopy. And um, this is, again, this is all preference. You do what you would like your project to be. I just like to throw out some suggestions on what it can be. Um, I even had a thought. If you're going with a farm theme for a baby nativity, I mean a baby uh, nursery there, oh, you could just do a whole bunch of these little chickens and make it into a mobile. I did think about that. Um, I wanted to throw it out there because, you know, I like the farm stuff too. So I didn't know if anybody else did and I kind of thought that would be a really cute little idea. Lots of little chickens because you could do all different colors. Or, you know, all the same. I mean, you do what you want, but you could do a whole bunch of chickens and maybe an egg. <laughs> I thought that would be kind of fun. But, you know, that's just me. <laughs> maybe I'm being silly, but ideas, ideas. We always throw out these little ideas because, you know, it gives everyone a, a chance to think about it. And if you have any, you're always welcome to post them. Um, or ideas on what to use projects for because I feel like the projects are a uh, a launch base for you um, just to get your imagination started with it so that you can make what you'd like out of it all right so don't feel like if I say oh it's a bookmark it does not have to be a bookmark you make it what you want it to be so I'm going to go on here and secure my wings just gonna keep putting along here with these. So you get your wings on, get them nice and secure. You make your chicken into what you want your chicken to be. And this was fun. I enjoyed this project. I like chickens. So for me, I, I think this is a good one. Um, hopefully you do also. So I enjoyed being on this journey with you. Give us a like and subscribe if you'd like to see other videos um, as they come out. And I'll see you next time. Keep working on your chicken. Thank you and have a joyful day.